Today we're talking about the different user levels that are available in the unit. Currently, we're logged in as an administrator with right access. You can see this by the user here with a check mark saying that this user has both view and change privileges. Looking at each of the slots on the UDIP POIs, the user has visibility to each one of these. You can see all of these are empty, and you can see the type of module which is in each one of these POIs. The user can also see the fans. Should they want to go to any of the POIs, they could make changes to them. You can see we've got the alarm status here. I can click on that and get the alarm status for any particular one of these POIs or go to the alarm page and see all of the alarms, which would also be SNMP be sent off to the NOC. If I wanted to set the unit up for someone to only view them, I would give them an access which would not allow them to make changes to any of the POIs as well as I could restrict access so that they couldn't even view what is in any one of these slots. The availability of all the users helps in a neutral host or multi wireless service provider scenario such that you can give different carriers access for viewing while in a neutral host you maintaining the control of all of the individual slots and POIs so that nobody can change the power or adjust anything. If you'd like we can go ahead and look at a different user And you can see here, now this user, they have the little red hash across there, so they do not have right access. And if you look at this user, I have previously given them access to only certain slots. They do not have access to these two slots, so if a different wireless service provider had those two slots, they wouldn't even be able to see what technologies or what signal levels are in there. I could do that for any one of the particular slots for one or more chassis. As you can see in this graphic here, we only have one chassis. I could actually configure multiple chassis in a primary and secondary role, and we'll see that in the next video.